Yeah, got a new show for y'all. Got a damn good show. Damn good show. So what's this dude, a motivational speaker? Yeah, man, I love motivational speakers, man. It gets me going in the morning. Ain't nothing like, like, soon as your alarm clock goes off, you know, wake up, go ahead and put that motivational speech on. Shut up, man. You don't do that. Yeah, I do. I do that all the time. I told you to do it, man, to help you. Yeah, it gets you going. It starts you going. It's like taking a, it's like drinking a cup of coffee, you know. And, I, and the best place to find some great motivational speeches, man, is TikTok, you know, which is saying something because TikTok is a cesspool for, for just garbage. This was a gem I found, a total gem. But I do got to warn you, um, shut up and just show the video. Wait, where's your, where's your, uh, just your phone, man. Hey, Kevin, it's right there in your face. Where? What is that? I don't have my glasses. Sorry. Sorry, it keeps on the rag today. But I, I do got to warn you before I play the video, there's, make sure you focus. Especially if you got ADHD. This is going to be a huge distraction. <laughs> Just make sure you focus. Listen, listen, listen. Man. Some of y'all is never going to make it to your destiny <laughs> until you learn how to clap in the audience for who's on stage. Amen, bro. See, y'all, a lot of y'all too busy trying to make it to the stage that you forget to clap in the audience. <laughs> oh, you understand what I'm saying? <laughs> You got to learn to be in the audience. You got to learn how to clap in the audience for who's on stage until it's your turn. <laughs> until it's your time to go on stage. Amen. See, a lot of y'all block y'all blessings because y'all don't celebrate y'all brothers and y'all sisters and those that are around you success. No, nah, y'all won't do that. Y'all sit back, be envious, look at them sideways, yep, and talk bad about them, yep. bring up all they past, bring up everything they done did, Bring up everything they didn't say before y'all even think to celebrate them. Let me tell you something. Yeah. It wasn't nobody in the Bible mm -hmm. that God used that was perfect. Amen, bro. So while y'all sitting down there judging Amen. the person that's on stage, wondering why your life in neutral, wondering why your life ain't going nowhere, remember that. Ain't nobody perfect. Not one man, not one woman. Amen. Everybody got a pass. Ain't nobody perfect. And I guarantee you won't make it to the stage until you learn how to clap in the audience. Man, it was powerful. Man, how do you close your mouth? <laughs> <laughs> I bet you when he go to sleep, he like this. <laughs> hey, you know what? You make Just teeth hanging out everywhere. You go in this room saying, <laughs> yeah, he's asleep. Damn, it's my wild. <laughs> like... Man, you make Steve Harvey's mouth look like baby teeth. <laughs> Steve Harvey look like he got 32 wisdom teeth in his mouth. <laughs> you like you got 50 wisdom teeth in your mouth. But you know what it is, his veneers. Yeah. And when he went to the dentist, them damn teeth was way too big for his mouth. Look like the dentist would have caught that. Look like you would have caught it when he said, look, I'm done. Here, I'm going to give you a mirror. Like when you're at the barber, see if the haircut okay. Hey, tell me if you want me to do something else. Here, look. Yeah, yeah, you be like this. <laughs> Yeah, they, yeah, I can see them. Yeah, I like them. <laughs> <laughs> I would, if I was you, I would sue that dentist. I mean, you've got one of the best smiles I've ever seen. It just, it's too big for your face. I mean, your teeth is so big, it makes your, I can't even see your chin. I can see his chin. It looks small compared to them teeth. That's what I was trying to say. This is a beautiful, he did beautiful work, it's just, but that mouth is sent for, is made for Andre the Giant. And that, that was expensive. Yeah, it's not cheap. This mouth probably cost him about, like, $36,000. Man, that mouth probably cost him $100,000. <laughs> you got enough teeth for three people. <laughs> Cut that nice up. What color of shirt is that? I don't know, I was too go focused great. on his, I was too focused on his teeth. Well, it go great with them damn teeth. <laughs> You should wear all black. <laughs> Man, that would look awesome. I bet awesome. you when you go out in town, you're not even noticing how people look at you. <laughs> you probably go up to somebody and say, hey, how you doing? They're like. <laughs> <laughs> you probably scared people. You don't, you don't catch those looks? Yeah. I would go back to the dentist, seriously, and get those teeth smaller. No, but seriously, like, 
Ed looked crazy on video. I can only imagine what you look like in person. Well, he said uh, the camera makes you look 10 pounds heavier, so I'm thinking his camera made his teeth look like about 10 pounds heavier. So he probably looked better in person. Man, you crazy as hell. <laughs> you like that damn, um, that Snapchat app? We mm. make your mouth all big? That's like what you look like. You know that app? Yeah, that app. You just sit down here. <laughs> you look like that. I at first I thought it was a uh, it was a filter, but I was like, no, it's look at no man, this is real. Yeah, man, that, man, you crazy as hell. Hey, suit that Stop motivational speaker. Work on yourself. <laughs> <laughs> that was a damn good show. Damn good show. Damn good show. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. I got more videos to watch. And to the young man, mouth is shit. Go back to the dentist and say, man, can What's, you fix this? Yeah. Scale it down. Scale it down about three sizes. <laughs> yeah.